this week i'm focusing all on digital planning so i'm definitely not the person that starts their new year reset in january mine happens in february so now i have to go in and edit the online planner that i made in canva for 2024 this is a logo that i made years ago that i tend to use on all the projects that i keep for myself I gave this planner a little simple title, a new background, and now it is all ready to go. Canva wouldn't allow me to make a project that was 300 pages long, so we're doing this in sections and I'm going to start with January through June 1st. January, I was still basking all in what was left of Christmas and definitely hiding out inside. So now that February is approaching, I'm ready to dive right into getting organized. I thought I would be able to just jump right into this and quickly get it updated, but I guess I really underestimated how long this took me last year to create, um, which everything was done from scratch. So let me just go in and adjust the year for this year and I will be right back. pink dots to the dates this year that are really special to me such as Victoria and I's anniversary, our birthdays, Sassy's birthday. It is also going to be a full year since she has been gone so I'm really hoping that this year we can do something really special just to honor her. I can't believe it's been a year right? Something I realized I didn't have in the last one was that I wanted to add a page where I can put quarterly goals. So I'm going to create a space here where I can add those notes in throughout the year, which I'm really, really excited about. Thank you. 
so this is how each week starts for me so I just go in and add the dates of the week um, in good notes when I'm adjusting it I'll go in and add some little notes um, here just make some check marks off of everything that I did for the previous week add in some things for my shopping list um, just for the week here each page also has a little quote of the week which I thought was a cute little touch um, and just a few little spots here where I can put some like major priorities like for the week so I really loved how this turned out I thought it's like so cute This is also something that's added each week for people like myself who create content, um, which is super crucial. So I'll go in and add everything to start off the first week of February on GoodNotes after I import it as a PDF. I also broke down each week by two days here, which I highlighted which days were at the top, which was just a fun little touch um, that I added in. And I also left out the times in the scheduling section because for me, I really like adding in my own times. It makes a lot more sense for me that way. 